Another view, a Tim X Moby erotica, by Sussy Bingus, requested by E Molly sixty five. Tim and Moby started out their day as they usually do by opening letters. Dear Tim and Moby, are you too gay? And if so, do you two have sex? Oh, um," said Tim, as he looked at Moby with lust in his eyes. That's a complicated one. We, uh, Tim got too flustered. Beep beep. Moby said, "Oh, yes. Let us show you how we, um." Tim paused, getting flustered, thinking about it. Beep beep. Moby said with a smirk, as he pulled out his cylindrical tin. Moby was already in Tim by the time Tim finished his sentence. Moby then grabbed Tim by the neck. Beep beep beep. Oh wow! I mean, as you can see, obviously. I'm the bottom, and Moby is the top. Tim says, as he lo- looks at Moby. Ah, Tim said, trying not to come. Beep beep. Moby started to fuck the brains out of Tim. They paused for a couple seconds, and Moby cleared the desk with one brush of his hand on the table. Moby picked up Tim and threw him on the desk. Tim knew that he was about to get fucked so hard for the sake of the video, so he bent over. Moby slowly inserted his cylindrical penis tin nine thousand into Tim. Ah! Tim yelled, "Harder, Moby!" At this point, they had forgotten to turn off the camera. Beep beep. Before they knew it, they had made a full-on porn scene as they came to a stop on their. Adventure. They cleaned up all the cum and other fluids from the walls and floors. Tim said, "Well, that was a good、uh, session, I guess." Tim got flustered once again. Beep beep. Moby said with a whinish sound in his voice. Well, bye, and see you next week. Tim said with a hot smirk. At this point, from all the fucking, Tim could not walk properly, so they went to the hospital to get him checked out. And it turns out, from all the hardcore fucking, Moby ripped Tim's asshole. In about five months, it should be fixed, the doctor said. Beep beep. Moby said, with anger in his voice. Two chapter two, healing time. Two months later. Moby has started getting angry and sexually frustrated since Tim can't have sex at the moment. Beep beep. No. Why would you ask that? You know I have to wait five months. Tim said with an angry tone. Moby got mad and hit Tim. Ow! What the hell, Moby? Why would you hit me? Tim was so hurt that he was in tears at this point. Moby was so upset with Tim that, at this point, Moby started beating the absolute shit out of Tim. The next day, beep, beep. what do you mean you're going out? Tim said, his face bruised up and bloody. Beep, beep. What job? You're a robot," said Tim with worry in his voice. "Ugh, fine, I guess." While Moby was gone, Tim decided to look through Moby's laptop to find out Moby had signed in up for multiple dating sites. One being named "Meet Twinks Near You for a Good Time." Time was Tim was so hurt by this. Beep beep. Oh, you're back, Tim said with sarcasm in his voice. Beep beep. Why am I mad? What is this? Twinks near you? You fucking slut! Are you kidding me? By now he was yelling at Moby. Moby got upset by this, so he kicked Tim in the asshole. Ow! 
Tim let out a moan. Moby was getting ideas by now. Wait, I'm still mad at you, Tim said. You know my hole isn't healed all the way. Tim whined, but Moby was now in Tim. Ugh, Tim moaned louder this time. Harder, I mean, stop. Tim was trying not to enjoy it. Before they knew it, they did the YMCA in bed. Moby proceeded to snap, crackle, and pop Tim's back, fucking him to the point where Tim couldn't walk. They had to go to the hospital for a checkup. Moby did not come with Tim this time. Beep, beep, he told him before he left the house, to now in bed, unable to walk, had to call the doctor to come over. And how are you feeling, Tim? The doctor said, knowing they had some steamy time. Chapter 3 What's Up, Doc? The doctor saw the way Tim tried to sit up and could tell that Tim wanted more. Ahem. <clears throat> it says you had intercourse while in the healing process. You know you're not supposed to have intercourse, right? Tim was blushing. Uh, yeah, I know. Uh, Moby kind of, uh, forced me, Tim said. But, but I enjoyed it, so... The doctor is getting bricked up at this point. Uh, well, that is you and your partner's business. I came here for your checkup. Um, can you bend over and pull your pants down, please? Oh, um, yes, doctor. Tim was getting too bricked up. As Tim bent over, he could feel the doctor looking at his asshole. Made him feel submissive and... I'm going to stick something up there, okay? Said the doctor. Tim, now trying not to moan, was ready for whatever was coming. Okay, Doc, ready. Meanwhile, with Moby, beep, beep. Uh, yeah, I come here often. I live here, God, said that twink at Femboy Hooters. Anyways, what's the robot like you doing here? Waiting on someone? Beep, beep. Oh, wow, that makes sense. Well, have you, you be? The twink walked off. A young boy walked into the Hooters. Uh, are you Moby69 Twink Stan? He asked. Beep, beep. Oh, okay, you are. Well, let's get going. Moby then walked the boy to a hotel down the street. Beep, beep. Uh, my name is Daniel, he said with a worried look in his eyes. Are we going to do anything? Like, you know, Daniel said with a smirk. Beep, beep. I mean, bites his lips. I guess... Daniel bent over, doggy style. Beep, beep. They started doing the deed. An hour later, Moby left him on the bed with his back broke. Back with the doctor. Ah, Tim moaned. The doctor had inserted his pee-pee into Tim. Moby walked in. Beep, 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 beep. Moby screamed. He was surprised to find Tim and the doctor doing the clock clock 69,000 in their bed, so he joined in. At this point, the three had been going at it like a crack orgy. The doctor had still forgotten to tell him that he had AIDS. <gasps> to be continued.